Good morning, everyone. Happy Sunday. Welcome back to my channel. My name is Rachel. Today I'm going to just be getting ready and I am going to do it on camera. <laughs> Hope you guys are having a happy Sunday. Well, right now it's only about, it is 6.45. <laughs> so maybe you're still sleeping. But I'm up. I've already cooked dinner for tonight. For the most part, I cooked my na my main dish. And I am putting on my sunscreen. This is the Equate Sunscreen Broadband Spectral S Spectrum SPF of 70. This is a water-resistant um, sunscreen. And it's not actually for your face, but I had it one day, put it on my face, and I loved it so much. I have never stopped using it. And it really, really, really does a good job under my makeup does make you glow and if you I can't use this if I haven't been using my moisturizers because when I don't use my moisturizers of course that makes my skin overproduce the sebum in my skin and so I end up with all kinds of problems <laughs> but I do like for my skin to be glowy after I do my makeup for today I'm gonna just put some drops in I'm not really sure what I'll be doing for today. I don't have a basket pulled of things that I am using right now. So I'm going to be using my Tatcha Silk Canvas. So I have been drinking, it, my goal has been to drink one full gallon of water every day. And so far I have not done the full gallon because I don't want to force it because I don't want it to be something that I don't stick to. And so I'm not forcing it. The first day I drank just about, just a smidge under a half gallon. And then the next day I did a full half gallon. And then the following day I did another half gallon. And then yesterday I did almost the entire gallon. There was just about this much left in the container. I was so proud. I really was. I really need to clean up my eyebrows, but that's not going to happen this morning. Looks like it's going to be pretty warm out today. Not um, too hot, but just warm. This morning I was just watching Jackie Taylor's um, video, her vlog video, and I'm telling you, just watching the beginning of it made me so hungry. Before she started sharing her avocado toast, I never had, I love avocados, but I had never had avocado toast. And then I tasted it and it was like so delicious. And actually her channel is, she has a new channel name. This is the Charlotte Tilbury Magic Powder, and this is in the color Tan Dark in number three. I love this so much. Now, I take the stopper out of my powders that I use to set my face simply because I like to use my really big puff in the powder. Put that in a little bit more. But I do find that when I am shaking it out and dispensing it from the, um, the cap, I tend to waste a lot of product that way. Whereas if I just take the stopper out and dip the sponge in, it works out a lot better. So, but then I don't, I'm always so afraid I'm going to drop it. And so I take some of the powder out and put it into another container. And then I just work with a small amount. Okay, I think that's good. Now for today, I wanted to try this sample card that I have from Estee Lauder. This is the Estee Lauder Skin Loving Futurist Hydra Rescue Moisturizing Makeup Broadband Spectrum of 45. It has coverage plus care, hydrates, smooths, soothes, protects, helps fight the visible effects of blue light and pollution with antioxidants, 12 hour radiant glow. Oh, okay. 
I'm already so glowy and I have oily skin. I don't know if I should try this, but <laughs> here goes. <laughs> so I have, it looks like maybe with this one, maybe rich amber would be my color right here. That looks right. So I will do a mixture of these three right here. I'll probably use the rich espresso as well. Oh, this is, um, no, rich amber, it might be too dark. Inside, that's what it looks like, but I'll still use it. It looks like it's the sandalwood that might be the better color. We'll see. And I will open up the one right above it, which is bronze. Those are the three colors. Let's see how this goes. <laughs> you know, I have been really happy watching a lot of um, the people that I watch regularly. They have been, oh, oh, I like that, sandalwood. <laughs> um, they have been uploading a lot, like, um, like every single day. And it can be it can be difficult when you get out of your routine of uploading. And so I'm going to try to upload this week every day. Just a little something. That's my goal. Will it happen? I don't know. I hope so. <laughs> okay. Now the sandalwood in this, I didn't, couldn't even see it on my skin, which is a good thing. I really like that. Feels good. Very beautiful. Feels good. So yesterday I spent almost all day outside and it was really nice. It was really hot out though really really hot but it was wonderful I brought a lot of my inside plants outside hopefully they're not cooked this morning and my daughter went and she hung out with a friend yesterday and a couple of friends and it was nice um, I just told her, make sure you don't take your mask off. And Oh, I missed her so much. It's like you want them to grow up and be responsible. And she's such a good girl. But it's just, it is an adjustment not having her here. So, or even just the fact that she's just like, okay, I'm going to go hang out. And they just went to a friend's house who's actually a little bit older than the both of them. And she's, and she's really sweet. She took them to, well, they watched a movie. And just to tell you how sweet they are, the movie they watched was Buzz Lightyear. That's how sweet. You know what I love about this um, Lancome Fix It and Forget It? This kind of reminds me of the Morphe Continuous Spray because you see how long this nozzle is right here? 
when you press it down, it just does a nice long mist and that also, and the mist is so fine. It doesn't super, super soak your face. It just does a nice long mist and it's just like, you can see it. See how it is? I'm going in with my yummy skin. And I am trying to remember to angle up and not down. I'm trying to identify the bird that sits outside of this window over here every morning, chirping away. I have been using this Juvia's Place Zulu palette for my blush palette because it is like so gorgeous. Um, I've been using this color here and this color here. Sometimes I'll use that one, but I'm not going to use that today. I'm going to use these two colors. Sometimes I even mix it in with a little bit of this yellow and I really 